Hey, I've got a special guest with me here, Kaylin Volander Pru. She's a three time state champion this year, won the 800, just got done one in the 200, and also won the 100 meters today. Kaylin, uh, how'd you get it all done? There are lots and lots of events this weekend. Yeah, um, I knew it was going to be tough, but I've been. Kelly Davis of Elk Point Jefferson was seven. Just so I could get used in to running six, on Riley Huff from Sisseton. I don't know, everyone is like, oh, it's too much, you're working her too hard, but I think I can handle it. If you're a good athlete, you can handle it. Yesterday, I was kind of paying attention to some social media posts from you and your dad, and uh, can you just turn around and give us a look at, at this? Tell me about um, your feelings during that 800 when you were thinking about former Todd County coach Tanya Whirlwind Soldier. Um, during the beginning of the race, I wasn't where I wanted to be. I was standing third. And coming around 300 meters ago, I was like, third isn't that bad. I can just settle for third. Yeah. But then going back there, that's I have a video of Tanya yelling at me my seventh grade year to push harder and go and go. And that just came to my mind. And I was just like, I wasn't raised to give up and quit. So I just gave it my all and I ended up being a champion in that. Tell me about the, the feather that you're wearing in your hair this weekend. Like, How does that represent you as where you're from and who you are? Um... Well, I wanted to show everyone like where I'm from. Athletes can be good from where I'm from. I'm a Lakota warrior. <laughs> yeah. So I wanted to wear this to represent myself and where I'm from. Mostly to like, honor Tanya. Held on last year's MVP. Okay.